Every year, the Institute Without Boundaries does a international uh, design charrette. And we have almost 150 students that have come to the Institute Without Boundaries. Uh, working here, we've kind of taken over the School of Design. And these students come from different schools. They come from actually all over the world. From Italy, from Denmark, from, from France, and also other programs at George Brown College to come together to take on a design challenge. Uh, and this year, the design challenge we're looking at uh, is the Toronto Ravine system. Uh, which makes up a large portion of the City of Toronto. And really what the challenge is for the students is to look at how the ravines connect with the communities that surround them and how the communities around the ravines can, can help influence how, how they grow within the city. So these are some of Nia's drawings about how we're going to use the water theme and how we're going to mitigate for the flood risk that's in the area of the ravines. What I like most about the charrette is actually having these international students coming. So not only do we see a mix of disciplines, so we see architects, graphic designers, system designers uh, working together uh, in this process, but actually seeing the different cultures mix. The name, like we choose the, the name of the god and his name is uh, Poseidon. And be, this is because the, uh, our site is next to the ra river. And uh, we use the wave line to show the river and uh, like I will create a pattern based on the wave line. So we want to connect community members by having them cross paths. So in our design concept, we created these clusters of buildings for mixed use, including residential, rentals, and retail space. If we start creating more diverse designers, uh, we start creating more diverse and better projects. 